myself Deepak and I'm going to discuss about a hexagonal nut and bolt which is M12 nut and bolt so see here I'll create again a new sheet so take a new sheet so first of all take one polygon the sides of polygon is 6 we create from the center of origin that is 0 comma 0 comma 0 and here asking inscribe or circumscribe so take inscribe inscribe of the circle 12 radius after then again create one circle here center of the polygon and radius is 12 go to isometric view and extrude this both objects to a length now it is extruded then go to solid here one edge fillet command is there I'll give radius 3.5 this one and say double enter now take one intersect command whatever intersect this both object that will keep here and remaining will delete it you see in realistic view okay again it's keep in 2D wireframe and top view then draw one circle the radius of circle is 6 and diameter is 12 this circle move some 12 mm upward direction and extrude it of the 48 distance okay and then go to solid and take edge fillet and the radius of this edge fillet is 2 and this corner I have filleted select here one in row command helix so i'll make one thread here so from center point the radius of this thread is six so make sure that your ortho is on then the radius is six for upward and lower is also six and the turns of this bolt is 24 because i have taken the length of this whole thread is 48 and pitch is 2 that's why i'm taking and the length is 50 50 it's go upward direction so move it some 50 okay after move again select this helix and move some 1 mm okay then go to front view yes here I have to create one triangle so in triangle go to one line and give the dimension of this line is 1.9 and move it from this to here okay then take one polygon polygon number of side of polygon is 3 3 side and edge method is there so keep edge method and draw and then I want to use here one line move some 
downward direction of this line here again move 1 mm or 1.5 mm 0.15 in this again trim this remaining that is unwanted portion and joint all this object enter after joint move this object polygon some 0.1 mm in this and delete the reference object okay then i'll use here sweep command select the object whatever you want to sweep and select the path of the sweep hmm, so it is swept see here in realistic view so it is like that so i have to remove some material here how to remove the material go to subtract this is my main object 3d solid and this helix is my subtracted object so press enter then select the subtracted object go to select enter and this is my subtracted object enter then my thread is created see here thread is created now i'll create again here one nut for nut purpose go to top view 2d wireframe and again create one polygon that is number of side is six from the center inscribed 12 radius Again, take one circle from the center and the radius is 12 then keep here in isometry view and extrude this both object some 12 mm then take solid fillet edge and radius of this fillet edge is 3.5 let both side press double enter okay uh, then go to intersect select both objects simultaneous and press double enter now object is subtracted then go to realistic view see here and move this one some downward direction here okay and then if you want to create the thread of this nut also then first copy this one copy this thread dimension of the distance 20 okay then subtract this is my main object and this is my subtracted object see thread is also created now whatever you move that thread again move in 20 distance that's original position then use union for this both simultaneous select and say enter now it is single object and this is again single object now here you can use the material in realistic material so go to n at mat in material we can apply here material in both close it so see here m12 bolt and nut is created like that you can create thank you for watching